My grandfather's clock was too large for the shelf, so it stood ninety years on the floor. It was taller by half than the old man himself, though it weighed not a penny weight more. It was bought on the morn of the day that he was born, and was always his treasure and pride. But it stopped short, never to go again when the old man died. Ninety years without slumbering, tick tock, tick tock, his life seconds numbering, tick tock, tick tock, it stopped. Short, never to go again when the old man died. In watching its pendulum swing to and fro, many hours had he spent while.